Now, here's the cool thing. In the studio right this moment is Robert Bledsoe. How are you? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Harold Lee Rush. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to WKKC, Robert Bledsoe. Thank you. Thank you very much. And now, you know, my first question is, um, what caused you to write this play? Because you're not plus size. Far from it, right? <laughs> right. Well, plus size came about after a discussion with one of my friends who she came in one day and she asked me a question that I didn't know if it were were rhetorical or not because I couldn't answer it. But she asked, why do girls, when they know that you're trying to lose weight, not see not say anything when they see the results? Mm. <laughs> and wow. I just sat there looking at her like, what? I don't know. I, I don't know where am I, I supposed know. to know this? <laughs> you know, uh, my friend had been taking... I, I knew that she had been taking these diet pills mm, uh, okay. to, to suppress her appetite, you know, and, oh, wow. and thus uh, work on maintaining her weight or getting her weight down. Okay. So I initially used that story, and it morphed into what it is today. Mm. All right. Now, let's do some background. You are, you're originally from Chicago. Yes. But you've been getting your higher education all over the country, right? From Minnesota to New York. Yeah, I've I've been all over the place. Uh, yeah, I'm from Inglewood here in Chicago. Uh, I graduated from Copernicus Elementary School mm. on South Troop, which I believe is now closed. Yeah, in the I'm pretty sure it Chicago is. Chicago yeah. Public School closings. Yeah. Um, I graduated from Whitney Young High School. All right. And for my undergraduate degree in English, I attended Gustavus Adolphus College in St. Peter, Minnesota. Okay. And I also have both a master's degree in English and master's in broadcast journalism from Syracuse University in Syracuse, New York. Dang, man. Why don't you get you some credentials, man? (laughs) He's loaded. Yeah, and it's really cool because people need to understand it. Everybody that comes out of Inglewood uh, has the potential to go wherever they want to yes, go. They and do. you're proving that. You're proving oh, that. I mean, you've gotten, gone and gotten three different degrees, two wow. master's degrees. That I'm really proud to know you. Me too. And uh, so now, okay, you decided to, to write the play, and then you decided to do something even more crazy. <laughs> you decided <laughs> to produce it yourself. Why? Why? Because I had no choice. Ah. I I finished plus size, I believe, in 2009, 2010. Mm, okay, okay. And I spent the next couple of years researching how to start a business mm-hmm. and um, trying to uh, solicit support. The backers and all for, that. Yeah. For that. Yeah. And there's just not a huge stream of supporters out there, you know, trying to give money to an unknown yeah. writer. Yeah. It's it's unfortunate, but it's true. So um, I remember out of these books, I, and I, I spent weeks at the libraries here in Chicago, specifically Harold Washington downtown okay. Okay. In, the, in the business section. I believe that's the fourth floor. Uh, one, one of the books in particular that I read Uh, on starting your own business had something in there about it wasn't at the top of the list Mm -hmm. but it was nonetheless on there which was borrowing from your 401k oh so that's what i did okay to to start my business okay all right to get to work on, on plus size okay so now specifics Plus Size opens uh, April 10th, which is next Wednesday, a week from tomorrow. Yes. And it's at, tell me about the theater. It's at the Greenhouse Theater, which is in Lincoln Park on the north side in Chicago. And it runs through the 14th. Okay. uh, So we need to make sure people understand this. Initial opening is four days from the 10th through the 14th, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And Sunday. Oh, and Sunday. Okay. The Sunday show is a matinee okay. at 2.30. All the other shows begin at 7.30. All right. First of all, let me give out a telephone number so people can write it down now so you can call and order tickets because we want you to be able to go and see this. want to give this brother some support. What's the telephone number? The telephone number is 
773-404-7336. Again, 773-404-7336. All right, and so you can also call and get information as well as directions to the theater. Is there a website? Yes, there okay. is a website. They can go to either my website, which Whichever is... Whichever one is easiest to. Okay. Okay. Well, in that case... Uh, We'll send them to the Greenhouse Theater. Since okay. I also gave them the Greenhouse's phone number, okay. I'll give them the Greenhouse okay. Theater's uh, website, which is www.greenhousetheater.org. All that is one word. Greenhouse Theater. Greenhouse Theater. Is it they spell it T-R-E or T-E-R? We, and it's spelled the American way, which T-E-R. is E-R yeah. as opposed to R-E at the end of theater. Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, Robert Bledsoe. Uh, are you in the can to uh, Tempest, Drew, yeah. Eric? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure Only if they don't tell, right? <laughs> uh, you know, somewhere down the line, aren't we all related? Yeah, true. <laughs> all right. Now, again, the, the idea of the play is it, it, it examines something that I wasn't aware of. The idea that uh, sometimes some women will uh, purposely invite their plus-size girlfriend to go with them out in social situations uh, so that they'll look thinner next to her. I was like, I was kind of like, wow, that's some cold-blooded stuff. It sure is. <laughs> you know? That's crazy. But, but when I thought about it, I said, well, you know, that's not necessarily something that that's really that w- people wouldn't do. People are, you know, we got things like wingman, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, I've heard of situations where some women will, and guys have done this too. If they're uh, darker skin, mm-hmm. they will take a light skin friend with them to attract. To attract. Wow. Right, right. Yeah, because they know, or they, they deal with the idea that, you know, light skin people will right. attract more attention. Uh, but the idea of the weight thing, wow. So now, what's your objective? What, what is your uh your goal in, in, in highlighting this in the play? Well, the play is a serial comedy. And a serial comedy, uh, for people that aren't familiar with the term, is a serious comedy. So okay. it, it's a comedy primarily, but it deals with serious issues. And a very serious issue uh, that's going on in America, and in particular black America, is okay. the issue of weight. Right. Especially black women's weight. Mm-hmm. You know, with themes like Big is Beautiful contrasted with uh, Shanti and Insanity and all the other uh, exercise craves or some people see them as craves. Others see them as money-making schemes. Right. Uh, so I guess in essence, plus size deals with with weight, but why... We want to lose weight. And also, who are we losing weight for? Mm. You know, it's, it's, it's complex, the whole issue and the whole notion of weight loss. You know, look on Facebook. You'll see tons of black women losing weight. Black women do eat carrots. You know, Mm -hmm. yet on these same sites, you know, there's a link to buy this Mm -hmm. or link to by that so in some ways i guess i'm asking the question are people losing weight specifically black women are they losing weight for them or for others Hmm. and at what cost because there are real costs if you look at the costs of uh of gym memberships of of weight loss uh programs in the country the jenny craigs the right. nutrisystems we're talking about a billion dollar industry oh yeah multi and yeah. at the at the same time the other costs what are the physical costs because yeah, there there the are costs. real costs to trying to lose weight fast yeah you know people do die yeah. and the play touches on all of these issues because many people are affected by uh, by weight and some of the complications that come from them, specifically diabetes. Mm-hmm. You know, mm-hmm. I, I, I lost two family members uh, to oh, diabetes, wow. and I have others in my family that have diabetes. So all these things, believe it or not, are wrapped into one. 
Mm-hmm. And in 90 minutes, will we solve all the all the problems? No. Well, but it, it the job of an artist questions. is to not to answer questions, but to ask them. Okay. And it's called Plus Size. Opens April 10th at the Greenhouse Theater in Lincoln Park. Again, the telephone number for, for more information, 773-404-7336. And uh, be sure to tell them when you get there. You're going to look for Robert Bledsoe and tell him, hey, I heard you on the radio at 89.3 WKKC, the new sound of soul in Chicago, baby.